There's a new leader of the Audubon Park Police Department in Louisville. Former Metro Police Lieutenant Doug Sweeney starts his new position as the acting chief of police there in Audubon on Monday. This comes after the former chief left the department amid discrimination and harassment claims. Tonight, people familiar with the troubled department are giving their input on the new man in charge. He's a familiar name in Louisville. 11 at 11's Chelsea Rabideau joins us live with their reactions. Chelsea? That's right, Doug. Uh, Doug Sweeney retired from the Louisville Metro Police Department at his post as lieutenant at the very end of July 2013. He'd been looking for a way to get back into the workforce full time when the job here at Audubon Park opened up. Within the past six months, the Audubon Park Police Department faced a lawsuit from a former officer and lost their police chief of two years, Jeffrey Cox. Oh, there's some issues. Uh, you know, I'm not aware of all of them. Uh, there was some problems, and the residents were upset about it. One resident we spoke to also noticed some questionable spending. Well, over the last few years, we've noticed the department, you know, buying a lot of things. Buying, you know, they have a mobile command center. They have. Uh, basically highway class interceptors for a residential neighborhood. It's always seemed a little suspicious. The lawsuit against the department was filed by former officer Kyle Nave. Nave claims he was fired from the department for being gay, and the Louisville Metro Human Relations Commission agreed, saying he was discriminated against for his sexual orientation. When the extent of the corruption came out, we were all kind of surprised. We were all, of course, surprised. But uh, We've gotten a good feeling from the new fella. He has already sold a few of the cars. The new guy is actually a familiar face around Louisville. Doug Sweeney picked up a few part-time shifts with the Audubon Park Police Department last year. The more I was here and, and got to know the neighbors and the residents and, and the officers on the department and other employees, the more I liked it. When former police chief Jeffrey Cox left, Sweeney was urged by colleagues to step up. I like the residents. I like the council. I like the challenges this job presented. Put my name in a hat, and I was fortunate enough to be selected. Residents say they're hopeful for the future with Chief Sweeney. As far as police coverage go, it's been getting better, but in the past, you know, a week could go by and you'd not see a police officer in a small neighborhood, which is a problem. So, you know, our, our taxes pay for that. Uh, it's about time for a change, so things are looking better. And Doug Sweeney actually just pulled up here outside of the Audubon Park City Hall. He was doing some patrols tonight. He is expected to be confirmed by the full council a little bit later this month, and then he will be Chief Doug Sweeney. Reporting live, Chelsea Rabideau, 11 at 11. Chelsea.